After the flood, the only people on the earth were Noah, his wife, and his sons, and their wives. Noah's sons and their wives had children, and their families grew so that after a while, there were many people on the earth again. They were all the same family, and because of this, they all spoke the same language. Nearly 100 years after the flood, one of Noah's great-grandsons, a man named Nimrod, decided to rebel against God's commands. He was a very strong and evil warrior. All the people migrated to settle in a lush country called Babylon. Nimrod was their leader because he was a strong warrior and he convinced his friends to follow him. They said to each other, We don't need God to rule over us or the rules that Noah taught us to obey. So they all chose to disobey God. They said, Let us make bricks to build a city and a tower that reaches the sky. Then we can worship whichever gods we want. Once again, God saw that his people were not following his instructions, but instead were disobeying him. God said, My people all speak the same language and are working together to do the wrong thing. This is only the beginning of what they will do together to disobey my commands. So God caused them to speak different languages so they could not understand each other's words anymore. This caused great chaos and confusion. Because they couldn't understand each other anymore, they had to stop building the city and the tall tower. The tower was called the Tower of Babel because this is where God confused their language. After that, the people scattered all over the earth. All the people on the earth come from Noah. It doesn't matter what color our skin is, what language we speak, or where we live. We all come from Noah because his family was the only family that survived the flood. Revelation chapter 7 verses 9 and 10 tells us, One day we will all worship together in heaven. It says, After this I saw a vast crowd, too great to count, from every nation and tribe and people and language, standing in front of the throne and before the Lamb. They were clothed in white robes and held palm branches in their hands, and they were shouting with a great roar, Salvation comes from our God, who sits on the throne and from the Lamb. God wants us to love and respect each other because we all come from Noah.